it's Miss Alana working on math, getting smarter and smarter every day, just like you. Are you ready for today's math assignment? Well, you better get ready. So today is Thursday, August the 10th, and here's your assignment for today. On a sheet of paper, make five addition problems and five subtraction problems using the list of given numbers. You can only use each number once. Write each problem vertically and solve. Check your work using a calculator, okay? So what's the first thing you need to do? First thing you need to do is get a piece of paper. So you need your supplies. What are you going to need? A piece of paper and a pencil. Remember, we don't write a pen. We use pencils in math unless you're checking your work and a calculator to check your work. So maybe you can use a pen once you check your work with a calculator and then use your pen to check that. All right, so we are going to get a piece of paper. Go ahead and write your name, first name, and last name on that. Write today's date. It is Thursday, August the 10th, 2017. And so I'm going to give you a list of numbers. Let me show it to you real quick. Bam, here's a list of numbers, okay? Let's go back to the direction. So using that list of numbers, and don't worry, I will put it back on the screen. You will select two numbers. Actually, you know what, if you wanna do three, that's fine too. Uh, you're gonna make five addition problems and solve it, five subtraction problems, and then solve that. Now, when we write our problems, we need to write it what way? Where's that, where's that word, where's that word? Bam, right there, vertically. That means straight up and down. I think some of you all were today, we're trying to do stuff horizontally, sideways, yeah, we're not doing that. Straight up and down, okay? That way, bam, the numbers are lined up straight up and down, okay? And then you'll solve those problems, and then you'll check your work. So here is your list of numbers. Read these numbers with me. Let's start at the top row, and then we'll just go down. All right, read that. 54, 78, 95, 23, 60, 81, 432, 921, 680, 375, 546, 6895, read, read the numbers with me, 3473, 2091, 8235, 7,007, 5,186, 4,900, 1,362, and on our last row, read these numbers, 16,950, 29,478, and 37,521. All right, so I'll leave this up here. So at the end of the video, you can just pause it or you can pause it now if you want to. But you can pause it at the end or just leave it up at the end. You need to write five addition problems, five subtraction problems. Now, for your addition problems, you can pick any two numbers. So for example, you could add 23 plus 78. Write that down, add it up, check your work with a calculator. Or you can add... 2,091 and 5,186, write that down, add those up. You can also add maybe three or four digit numbers, I mean, not three or four digits, three numbers together. So you can add 921, 546, and 29,478. You can write those numbers down for a challenge. Actually, it's not, it's so easy. Write those down and then add those up. And then after you're finished doing your five addition problems, write five subtraction problems. Now the difference between adding and subtracting, when you subtract, you can only do two, two numbers at a time, okay? So you can't write three numbers and then try to subtract those all together. That's not gonna work. All right, so pick two numbers. So for example, you can have 81 minus 54, write that down, work it out, check it with a calculator, or you can write, 8,235 minus 1,362, subtract that out. Now, here's another, blah, 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 blah. All right, another difference too is when you're subtracting, what number always goes on top? The, not the smaller number, the larger number. Make sure you write the larger number on top because otherwise, 
can't subtract that properly. That's something you learn in middle school. Uh, unless you're ready, I can teach you how to subtract and you get negative numbers. So remember when you subtract, the greater number, the larger number goes on top, the smaller number at the bottom. And again, you can have one number that has four digits and the other one has three digits. That's fine. So go ahead and pick your numbers, write five addition problems, write five subtraction problems, work those out and check it with a calculator. And you can use the pen when you're done checking, but make sure you get those right, okay? All right, so that is your assignment for today. Make sure you get that done. Make sure you bring it to class tomorrow. So I'm not doing a tutorial today. We worked on that stuff. We, we worked on adding and subtracting today. So did we do that? We did some adding and multiplying. So you should know how to do that. If not, you can call me or message me if you need some help, if you have any questions. So if not, get that done. Have it tomorrow. Love you.